transfer, and D is very happy to be playing for the Rams as Grayson now throws complete, and the big man to watch, Knowlton. There's not just one go-to guy. Now they flash the end around with Hansley, number 25, and Sunday football someday. Keep an eye on that match. The scouts are watching it. Sambrello does a pretty good job that time and almost intercepted. Grace in the time he needed. You see it coming off the outside here. That's a good clean pocket. Slides to his left. That's a good throw. And First Colorado State drive, so Grayson trying to get the running game going, and that was D. Hart with his first carry has checked in as the running back. Play action. Complete, but it's third and long. Four wide receivers on this third down for Grayson. And incomplete. Watch indeed. Well, we were looking at tonight. Here's Gerald's on that delay. And uh, motion out of the backfield. And that was Higgins. Really nice cap. That's a 20-yard game. They get their initial first down. They've got the ball at midfield. Gerald's is still a running back. Nothing so quickly. Now they're starting to get back on rhythm. Grayson wants to set that screen pass with Higgins, and he was jumped immediately. Very good. Get the line of scrimmage. Let's see how he does here. Third and nine. And that's interference. Ball on the Utah 39-yard line. Grayson flips that screen over to the outside. They're going to throw it back now to Grayson. He's got a wall. Big game. End zone ahead. Touchdown, Rams. Field. D. Hart now moves into the backfield. He gets the first carry. It's interesting. Dave Baldwin, second down and seven. Play action. Has plenty of time. He's got 82. And the big play, Rashard Higgins. Kevin O'Brien is the center, snaps it to Grayson. Grayson dances away from trouble. There's a penalty flag on the completion, however. A couple interesting things here. One, there's a chip here on Orchard to try and slow that pass rush down by D. Hart, but right here is where you're going to see the hold. It's almost a full-blown tackle. That allowed Grayson to get outside and find the completion. that I have here. Do that toss play. To D and uh, not much doing that time. Uh, they like that post with Rashard Higgins if they can get there. Grayson looks and comes in underneath that time to the taller Williams. Takes a look at that defense. Entirely different offensive formation after that timeout. Grayson hit under enormous pressure that time. Grayson up under center uses Gerald's in the middle of that defense. And he Second down. They stuff the running play again. Gerald's, and this will bring up Latulale is number 93, and he's only a freshman. They're in on Grayson, but he gets it off. However, it'll be a punting situation. He's on a, I yeah, he was yeah. on a stage. <laughs> First down is Grayson with a completion. You know, one of the things, Jesse, I'm not seven and one in bowl games under him. You know, that's a very, very good point. Play action here. Grayson comes in underneath, and it is that wide receiver. Utah's secondary, in my opinion, are not great cover guys, and if they can give their quarterback time. Let me remind everybody that that was the third and final timeout of the half for Colorado State. Grayson sack. He's down at the 30. Is the ball free? It's going to be down. Yeah, we talked about pass protection, how it needs to be key. Bad right there. Second and 20, and Grayson in trouble again. There is no question. Front against Colorado State's offensive line. Yeah, you see, it's Orchard outside that kind of flushes Garrett Grayson to get to the left, and then. But the Seattle Seahawks have built an unbelievable defense around. Here's a pitch now to D. Hart, trying to stretch it and cut back. And well short. Oh, congratulations, so, well done. Gerald's uh, checks in as the, uh, the running back. I want to follow up on that story. Bit of a character, folks. He's 100% Aussie. That means you love spending some time with him. Has struggled on third down, which is unusual for them. Not this time. They pick up the first down. Hansley. 
across, but look at the pro right here, the protection around Grayson, giving him time. Hasn't always had that. Still got 353 remaining here in the first half. They're down a couple of touchdowns, and Geralds breaks a tackle. D. Hart in as the blocking running back and incomplete. They flush Grayson. He's on the run, and he's not going to get it. Well, we shall see, and uh, here comes D. Hart with the first carry. Are going to be the guys that win this game for them on offense. Second down and seven coming back with the transfer from Alabama. By far his best run of the game. That's why he's the home run threat he is, having rushed for 16 touchdowns. So from the 32-yard line, they flurry him as a receiver, and then they go to the outside man. Quick throw to Higgins who cuts for a nice gain to the Utah 45. Grayson. And a beautiful wow. catch on break. And Williams is a guy at six foot four. He's almost like a tight end. And he can work the middle of the field and make those plays. A very good touch on the ball. NFL taking a long look at him. E. Hart going nowhere. Oh. Throwing that second and long situation right from the beginning of a series. And Grayson from the pocket fires. Incomplete. Oh, from Sombrero. Fumble. Ball loose. The initial signal. Going to stunt inside. That's where he's going to get the pressure. Colorado State is kind of late on the switch. He's able to push off Zerbliss, and he gets to Grayson. A strip out here. Grayson, ready to see what he can do, and incomplete it will be second down. And salute. Miss Taven, you know, you talked about the basketball team playing tonight. Yeah, good doubleheader. The running attack, Gerald's going nowhere. Plays the first time we've seen him there. Grayson again in trouble. Incomplete and intended for William. Lights out. He's going to have to throw it under duress. Throw that wide receiver screen. Five receivers out wide. Under enormous pressure. On the field. You're going to see it come from right here. It's Justin Thomas, and he's the guy they like to send pressure. Grayson, did he come up and fumble it again? It's Utah football. Rams, his favorite team, they've got the football now. And uh, couldn't hang on, has been contacted. And he just won a minute, Jesse. Second down and 10. Hit on the release, intercepted, picked off. Demick, it's Latulale, watch number 90 right here in the middle, he's going to get his hands on, on Garrett, force that football up in the air, Bingham does, getting this football team prepared to play. It's obviously a point of emphasis with him, Jesse, and he also gets uh, the practice session, is it? they still have a lot to build with when you get that offensive line back. High and grabbed by Williams. Grayson. Drops it off underneath to Gerald's. Picks up. Very interesting year for Utah on the south. Oh, Higgins is ripped that time by the second down and seven. Drops it off now to Hart. Third and two, and then uh, they're going to put the uh, Utah schedule up in it. You throw it away. And, uh, Wilson was unbelievable. 91 yards make it and three touchdowns. An incredible performance for our player of the game. And, uh, and this is the eighth time now he's won a bowl game. Don't know where that's coming from. Grayson's in trouble. Strip ball loose. The man that whistled dead. 